All right, guys, welcome back to South Park, the Stick of Truth. Let's see if we can, uh... Yeah, there we go. You guys can't mess with us. All right, let's see. Ah, no, let's, we gotta... There we go. What? There we go. What was that? Oh, what the hell? We have to fight the rat? Oh shit, I didn't- I wasn't expecting him to hit us. That was so weird, I did not expect- uh, that's fine. <laughs> and the rat has so much health. What the? What the hell? That was weird. There we go, we killed two of them. That works for me, definitely. Oh, Roid Rat. Wood Elf Gloves, okay. Go ahead and take a look at that in a second. Alright, so, let's go ahead and check out our inventory, because we got some gloves. It's the Wood Elf ones I made from Trifecta of Strong Leathers and Fabrics. Adds three armor, reducing enemy attacks. Um, bow attacks inflict 10% more damage, and rage weapon attacks inflict more damage. Now, how are the ones we currently have? Range attacks do 5 more damage. Perfect attack reduces shields by 2. And adds 1 armor. I think I'm going to go with the Wood Elves. Yeah, it gives us a little bit more armor. Alright. Before we go down there. Take care of these stupid rats. Nowhere to run, Bard. Give me the stick of truth. Take it from me if you can, Wizard King. Step forward now and fulfill your de de and fulfill your de de de. Step forward now and fulfill your de Step forward now and fulfill your de de your de your de de. Step forward now and fulfill your de de your de your de de. Step forward now and fulfill your. I was gonna say, when the hell are we gonna let this fulfill your destiny. You are no match for a grand wizard. The stick belongs with us, and I shall use every bardic power in my class to keep it from you. Ah, you want to throw down, brah? Kick his ass, douchebag. Who is douchebag? That's Sir Douchebag to you, and he's about to teach you some manners, bard. All right, let's teach this bard some manners. He has 1,620 Set health. Him Knock him down. All right, let's see. We got a little bit of mana. One of our abilities, got the bull, we'll charge headfirst into an enemy, having armor, removing shields, and inflicting defense down. So he doesn't have any armor, so that wouldn't do us any good. Now these guys don't have too much of anything, but we can't attack him yet, so let's go ahead. You want to this? Okay. Defenses are down. Let's see her abilities. Royal Chaos Princess Kenny plants a kiss on the enemy to catch them completely off guard, grossing the out the target. That might be good for us. Oh, I can't go over there though. Yes, we can hit everything. 
Hopefully we can shake him enough because I think it'll kill all little rats. Whoa. Well it did, but it also killed Kenny. Gently now put your mind to Wow, what a terrific target. Alright, do we have any more I don't think we have a revive per thing is the thing. Oh we don't. Go ahead. Let's take a strength potion, I guess. Is that all you got? Okay, maybe we should try a magic. Oh, we need more. We need more mana. Let's go ahead and just keep doing this one, I guess. Oh, he came back. Is that all you got? Oh yeah. Okay, so he's still frozen or slowed, I should say. Is that all oh, you got? How, did, how was that okay. too late? Oh well, we got the second one. Oh, you dirty witch! Nate. Unfortunately, her attacks aren't too much. Let's go ahead and see if we can slow him again. Alright, he slows some more. Close your eyes, no more thinking about, thinking about your troubles. Sleep now with Jesus, for you are blessed. <laughs> Alright, so we're awake, but Kenny is asleep. Let's see if we can take a mana and also grow some out. Health mana, there we go. Alright, so let's go ahead and do a dragon shout. There we go. Did 129. Andy's grossed out. He's stunned, still bleeding, so. On your nets. Let's see. I mean, I think just doing that's going to be good for us. Alright, so he's not slowed anymore. Let's go ahead and do the royal kiss. Epic kiss. Oh, that almost. All right. I will definitely take that. Let's do some more slowing. Damn, we did it too late, so we didn't slow. Just slow No more thinking about thinking about your troubles. Sleep now with Jesus, for you are blessed. Wow, what a terrific target. You to a swine shagger. Uh, oh yeah? Kenny wasn't, he was defenseless. Oh yeah? Yowza! Her, or Kenny, can her. Kenny's main attack really isn't that great. Switch. It only does a total of maybe 30 or 40, I think. Yeah, it doesn't do very much. But we got him. The stick is ours! Yay! Alright, 74. No level up, though. I don't want to talk to you. I want to search this cupboard. There we go. Talk to him later. Crutch of Weakness, level 4. I 
Alright, oh, he's got the one ring from Lord of the Rings. Pretty cool. Find his running shoes. Just kidding. Oh, that's not funny, Cartman. Alright, oh, level four wood elf cap. All we need to do is buy some more uh, revives. Ready to leave, Sir Deucebag? Okay, but hurry up. This inn is no longer safe for our kind. Right, I just want to check out the stuff we got. So we got a Mace of Restoration. Oh, wait, no. The Crutch of Weakness. Uh, lulls opponents into false confidence 30 to 42 times 3. Let's see, this is 23 to 32 times 3. But this one on perfect attack heal 5% of your HP. Plus adds a 10% damage on perfect attack. This one on pro attack weakens target's attack. That's pretty good, I'll be honest. And we have a good amount of health. Let's go ahead and try it out. And it does a lot more damage. Alright. Dude, seriously? Adds one armor, reducing enemy attacks. This one adds three armor. Gain one PP on bow attack, which we don't use, so we won't be going with the wood elf cap. Oh, wait. What are we wearing? Wait, the wood... Oh, okay, no, okay. Well, we get a lot more with this one anyway, so we, yeah, we won't be uh, wearing that at all. Okay. Oh, I think that... I think that's pretty much it. Let's go ahead and just talk to Carmen and get out of here. Ready to leave, sir, douchebag? Stick of truth is back where it belongs. Great job, men. Douchebag, for your heroic deeds and valiant self-sacrifice at the great battle of the Giggling Donkey, I hereby make you an official member of the Kingdom of Koopa Keep. Welcome to the KKK. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting late. The Grand Wizard needs to go night-night. Okay, Mom, thanks for pointing out bedtime for everyone. It's a school night, hon. You and your little druid friends need to- We're not druids, Mom! We're fucking warriors and wizards! That's it. You're going to bed. The rest of you better get home, too. Okay. Unfortunately, we can't buy or sell anything or use fast travel. New quest. It's late. Ooh. Return home. I got you. I got you. All right, let's go ahead and check out. All right, so. Oh, okay, it's just over here. Oh, one more over. There we go. Well, there he is. You make any new friends, sweetheart? Nothing to say, huh? What a surprise. It's late, sweetie. Go on up to bed and I'll be there to say goodnight. Can't even hit them? The kind of assholes. Alright, let's get up to bed. Uh, no, that's the bathroom. I, or is this? Your mother said. Okay. What the? Uh, now we don't need to store anything. Actually, let me check and see if we got anything to. Oh, we should be able to take this off. Yeah. Go ahead and unequip that. And put only one on here, so that kind of sucks. Let's see, what do we want to put? Deflect 10% more damage when you block. Gain 1 PP on perfect attack. Or adds 10% damage on perfect... We'll go ahead and add that one.
I didn't realize I could modify the snowball. We got deflects 10% when you block, gain 1 PP on perfect attack. Uh, let's go with health PP, I guess. Good night, little man. I hope you're as happy as we are. Everything is going to be better now that we're in this quiet little mountain town. That's what the aliens say, they talk in cow for some reason. I'm having a dream again. Okay. <laughs> Dreaming. What's happening? Oh! Jesus! Jesus Christ! Oh! Can we try the big silver one again? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh god. Is this your first time getting probed? Yeah, it's a pain, but this is the kind of stuff you put up with living in a remote little mountain town. At least we don't have to deal with traffic. Hey, you broke free! Kid, you have an incredible control of your asshole! Get me loose, too! Okay, you can use your newly acquired alien probe to teleport. Hold L1 and choose the alien probe, or tap L1 until it's selected. Escape the holding area. Hold L2 to activate the probe and aim with the directional, or L or R. Wow, look at that! You must have broke off part of the probe and now you can control it with your sphincter muscles. Pretty cool. Uh, I'm surrounded right by here. some kind of force field. Go find a way to shut it off. When you break me free, I can show you how to get off the ship. All right, let me look for stuff first. Alien helmet. Ooh. Let's go ahead and check that out. Enhances vision and hearing to superhuman levels. Takes two AA batteries. Weapon attacks do 10% more damage. Let's see. This one doesn't add any armor, unfortunately. And that one adds two. This one heals five HP each turn and regen two PP, so I think we'll keep the druid one. These ones add six armor. Crap, what did we have before? Melee attack enemies up to 30 damage. Each attack leeches 10 HP. Yeah, that's pretty good. It's over here. We can't go over there. Oh, oh, yeah, that's right. Used Jagan. Gross. Hello. Alright, so they have a barrier for us. Uh, find the control room. See you later, bitches. All 
All right, let's see. We got a... Uh... Ah, uh, hello. Is this recording? If you are hearing this, I've been taken hostage on some kind of alien ship. The aliens did unspeakable things to my rectal cavity. But I've broken free. I'm so scared and alone. I must find a way off this ship. Oh, God, they're coming. Why am I standing here making an audio lock? I don't have time for this. Leave me alone. <laughs> I love those audio logs. Crap. Let's see. Shan't I be able to go over here? No? Okay. Let's see. Oh, I didn't realize I could break these. See, so hmm, there we go. All right, we got one maybe stunned, but it should be Argo first. Moo, moo. Uh, it doesn't seem stunned at all. All right. How much health you guys got? Not too bad. Ooh. Oh, we got a shield. Alright, let's go ahead. He's got three. Ooh. Hmm. There we go. Oh, what well, that only took down Ooh. one, so that wasn't very good. And he healed. Ooh. Damn. Ooh. All right. Hopefully you can't put it up too much. Come on now, don't put it up again. Crap. For some reason, I can only block this. I can't block the first one. Let's go with a small. See how much it heals. Ah, good amount, actually. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Oh, you know what I should have used? Bull Rush. Let's try it out. Right, hold X until you're seeing red. Ooh. There we go, and almost killed him. Oh, you stupid alien. Actually, you know what? How much do we need for this? Ten? Might be able to kill him if we can get some more PP. Let's see, I don't really need a large one. There we go. Oh no, it's a power potion. Ah, you know what? I think we can do without. I didn't realize I only had two of them. Space medicine, you stupid alien. Ooh. Ooh. Alright, we got him next turn unless he heals. Yeah, we got this bitch. Moo 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 moo. Moo moo. Alien ray gun. Space cache, glowing crystal fragments. Only can. Oh, hey, oh. there you are. Oh, yeah, yep, that's the Lambda containment block. Take that elevator next to you. The probe in your asshole should interface with it. 
All right, but first, let's go ahead and check this weapon out. All right, ours currently does 75 to 93 and freezes targets. This one only does 75. Um, but plus 30 on shock damage, so it technically does 105. Hits a complete row of enemies, and perfect attack reduces shields by 5. That's not too bad. Let's see. Game 1 PP we have currently on this one. Whoops. Let's go ahead and try out the alien ray gun. Security console should be one above you in probe maintenance and another below you in the atmospheric processor Yeah, I know this stuff can't remember which one you want though been a while since I did this All right, so we got an alien suit as well. Let's go ahead and check that out Your spent probing humans have given the visitors a selective view of anatomy feels like a push-up bra on your sphincter Oh god gain a shield that blocks two hits at start of combat, not too bad. But this one has no armor, and we have six with this, so. Oh, okay, I see. Put us right up here. Boom! Oh, okay. That's interesting. I had no idea you could do that. Let's see, what was I... I guess just that one. Let's see if we can do anything on this side. Whatever that is. It's in there's a force field over there. Ooh. Oh, we can't get over there. And shoot him. There we go. Move, he's stunned. Move. Move. There we go. Easy as pie. We took down the other guy, so it was really easy. Ooh, we got hit. Alien Defense Matrix. Oh, another one of these. Day two. So hungry. I've searched for food, but the only thing I've found are other people's annoying useless audio logs. Why did they bother when they clearly were in terrible danger? Each audio log I find is more irrelevant and boring than the last. I must keep looking for a way to survive. <laughs> I find that so funny. How do we get over here? Oh. Maybe not. Uh, 
I have no idea. I'm not a hundred percent sure right now. Uh, okay. Ooh. You really couldn't see it at all. Let's go ahead and check this audio log out because they're hilarious. Day four. I've looked everywhere, but I can't find anything to eat or a clue to get me off the ship. Just more audio logs. They're everywhere. For some reason, I listen to every minute of every one of them, thinking there'd be some useful information, but it's like they're just filler. Useless filler. They're filler that's driving me to madness. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, we've already been over here. Okay. All right, so we can go down there, but two aliens. Hmm. If you want to be smart about this, let's move this over here. There we go. Killed one of them. Ah. We can kill them both. Move All right. Move. That's awesome. Great, you're there. See if you can free me from that con. Oh, crap. Keep going. I think you're onto something. <laughs> I knew I could trust you. Keep it up. Uh, I'm still stuck. Better try the other console. That. Okay, I didn't know that was gonna happen. Score! Aliens hate electricity! Playing a little bit of, uh. memory. Day 7. Okay, I did find one audio log that was mildly amusing. A woman trapped on this ship left an audio log about some papers she had left in an alien cabinet. And she told me the code was 776. That was kind of cool because I didn't know the code before that. Though when I opened the cabinet, there was only some kind of power-up I didn't really need. <laughs> oh, God. This is perfect. But we can now get up to the uh, other level, which we couldn't before. Okay, let's try the other console. God, I hope this works. I can't get in there. Okay, no. But uh, anyway, we're running out of time right here, so we're going to end it here. And uh, in the next one, we may even free Randy. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a great day, and I'll see you. Bye.